former coach, <sighs> Bobby Papioni, to discuss that wild ride. So welcome. Thanks for having me. Talk about the wild ride um, and, and how you started off and got to where you are today. Um, I don't know. I think it honestly, I started playing when I was five and I just fell in love with the game. Um, was always outside playing with the ball in my backyard and just playing as much soccer as I possibly could. And I think just my love for the game is kind of what has carried me to get to this point. So at one point it went from like fall soccer to winter soccer <laughs> to spring soccer to summer soccer. You played consistently, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I was on my first select team when I was in third grade. Um, and that was probably when I started playing year round and it's been pretty fun. So when did you meet Bobby? Um, probably freshman year of high school. And clearly you identified the talent at that early age. Well, we always saw some great things in Rose, but, but really Rose herself was the one that, that drove her to be where she is today, you know, her passion for the game and love for, uh, you know, just getting better every day. And it's amazing to see the things that she's accomplished because of the hard work that she's put in. And she deserves everything that she's gotten. And, just recently to be drafted number one is such an amazing thing for, for her and the city and, and obviously for our club since Mighty United. Well, talk about that being drafted number one and where that leaves you right now and what your life will turn into moving ahead. Yeah, um, I had kind of known for a little bit. I talked to the coach previously, but it was one of those things that didn't really seem real until it actually happened. Yeah. Um, I haven't been to Boston yet, so it's going to be a completely new experience, new team, new environment, but I'm excited. So when you're at that level, and we talk about that level being a, a level that is very rare for people to get to, how does your game change? And I would imagine this is probably a thing that you think about too, because the game is so much more than footwork and skill, it's also mentality wrapping around the enormity of where you're gonna be. Yeah, there's a lot that goes into it. Um, obviously not just on the field stuff, I think the thing that I've learned the past couple years that I have to stay on top of is uh, my recovery and just taking care of my body because obviously at that level it's a lot higher of a demand. So I've kind of had to take a step back and make sure that my nutrition is good, my recovery is good, and I'm just doing everything I can possibly do to be successful on the field. And Coach, you foster that in your current teams and in the club right now is, is to provide that insight at an early age to move girls and, and guys, for that matter, to this level. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we, we definitely talk about trying to be a complete player, obviously developing a love for the game, but also the important things of not just the X's and O's and skills on the field, but uh, the, the needs to take care of yourself with, with everything that you do, uh, from nutrition to sleep, and obviously academics when they're, when they're in school before they head off to college, and in her case, obviously, with the women's national team. And, and the pros, but it's important to um, really develop as a complete player to be able to be at this highest level. Wow, so I mean, is this, I know you've worked very hard, but, and I know this is probably maybe a dumb question, but are you at all shocked that this came to fruition? Um, yeah, I mean, like I said before, it's really one of those things that doesn't seem real until it actually happens. And then you're like, I really did it. Yeah, yeah. Um, but looking back, I've had a lot of help along the way. Yeah. Um, Obviously, Cubs has done great things for me, and they still, they still, you know, let me jump in on practices. Bobby obviously helps me do some um, technical work on the side. Um, so I, it, it hasn't just been me. I've had a lot of people help me along the way, and I know that without them, I wouldn't be at this point. Well, here's to being an inspiration moving forward, so congrats. Thank you. Seriously, congrats to you, Coach. I mean, it says a lot about you, too, to have her here, so. Oh, well, she deserves it. She's earned it. We're really proud of her. Fantastic. Thanks, guys. A lot more information on this fantastic athlete on our website, fox19now.com. Coming up, a lot of progress.